Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q2 of the bi weekly contest 47. And this was a tricky one, even though I did it in a couple of minutes, but pure really good math. Uh, anyway, check if number is a sum of powers of three. Uh, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this problem. But the, the thing, the, the tricky thing, and I had to prove to myself a little bit uh, for this problem is just try to figure out what numbers are not possible. Um, so for me, because you only get one instance of each uh, number of power of three, the way that I thought about it is, you think about it as a ternary number, right? Oops. So basically you break n down to a ternary number, and then if you look at the n number, it's going to look like, you know, one zero one one zero two. you know, basically because it's a ternary number, every, every digit is going to be zero, one, or two, right? And each power of three, if you look at it, it's just going to be, look, looks like this, uh, you know, basically, you you get the, your pattern here as well, which is that um, you know, for each power of three, the ternary number, which is base three number, let me add that here just in case, uh, the base three number will only have one in its digit, right? And as a result, you can kind of see where we, what's impossible, and what's impossible is if the third, if the base three number. Uh, has a two in the digit, then it's not possible because you only have one of them. So that's basically how I solve this problem uh, in terms of algorithm. And then you can look at the code here, which is straightforward with respect to that, which is that we, you know, we look at a digit at a time. If the digit is equal to two, we turn four. So otherwise, it's just true. Um, and what is the complexity of this? This is going to be linear time. Uh, this n is not that same n. It's actually log of the input n, uh, where n is um yeah this is log base three if you want to call it that which is which is the same as log log of n but i just want to make it clear but this is linear in the number of bits um yeah and in terms of space you could also say as long as you're consistent which is it's also linear in the number of bits i suppose or or one if you want to go the other way um so yeah uh because you only use one extra variable uh but yeah But yeah, but that's all I have for this one. Let me know what you think. Uh, and you can watch me solve it live during the contest. Next. Ten to the seven. Hey, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, hit the like button, the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you, how you did this contest and how you did on each of the problems. Um, yeah, H have a good day. Have a great weekend. Um, you know, to to good health, to good mental health, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.